Hey guys, this is James. Say, I've been scratch building and kit building model airplanes for 45 years. Covered, covered the uh, airplanes with all kinds of different fabrics and uh, with uh, the films, with the monocoat. I've uh, done a lot with that. I've done several with um, SIG. Uh, nitrate and butyrate uh, tacked it down with uh, the sticks it and uh, of course SIG's classic coverall um, had extremely good uh, results with that um, shrinks beautifully you spray paint your plane uh, it, it just comes out flawlessly um, my next project I'm going to use the um, the poly brush system with the uh, tacking it down with the uh, poly tack and then finishing with the um, poly brush and then I have a poly tone paint to finish it off this is the uncertified um, light fabric uh, which I also got from aircraft spruce online it's similar to the SIG in the consistency of the way it feels uh, SIG's is obviously lighter uh, more transparent you can see and um, this material here is uh, slightly thicker um, much tighter weave um, which that's gonna be a plus because I don't see having to put as much um, poly brush on to uh, fill the weave opposed to SIGS lighter fabric with the nitrate and then of course I've seen a lot online I haven't covered a plane with it but I've used it on little um, sample pieces which I'm gonna be doing again I'm gonna make up uh, a few of these you know just balsa stick squares and put down some fabric and tack it and and then use um, the poly acrylic and then use the nitrate and then use the poly brush to uh, show the differences between uh, the different types of covering opposed to obviously you know the classic iron down it's already colored plastic monocoat film um, this fabric um, is uh, polyester it's a hundred percent polyester it's um, dress liner that I bought by the yard at Joanne fabric it has, um, in my opinion, the same tightness of weave, um, but this feels more like um, a cloth, um, but the strength is definitely there. It's not uh, flimsy by any means, but it's soft, uh, opposed to uh, the, um, uh, the uncertified light fabric, the poly uh, fiber you can get um, online. You can hear it. It, it, it. It's almost it's it's stiffer, okay, and it's not as soft and pliable as you know the dress liner fabric. Um, I have used this on a, on a test piece, and it shrank really well. I was very surprised. It it actually came out pretty nice. Um, so we're going to be doing three different. Uh, uh, things uh, we're gonna do the um, the dress liner 100% polyester with the poly acrylic and we're gonna tack it down with the um, you know the uh, yellow glue uh, type on and then we're gonna do SIGS coverall and we're gonna tack it down with sticks it and I'm gonna put a coat of nitrate dope and the newest thing which I've never used before uh, the uncertified light polyfiber and uh, use the uh, tack it down with the poly tack and one coat of the poly brush all right i'm gonna probably have to make this a two-part series and just um hang in there give me uh, some time and i'll get this done we'll check out the next video